Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw, I'm sorry, this is Halloween drawings. And Halloween is getting closer every day. And I'm going to try to do more videos because I'm not going to update this channel too much after Halloween. So, you know, let's kind of get into it. Um, I'm going to be using a Sharpie marker. We're going to be drawing a cute Halloween Beetlejuice, essentially. Um, basically, cute Beetlejuice. So let's kind of get into it. We're going to start, well, I'm using a Sharpie marker with a little bit of a point. I'm going to draw a round, kind of upper, under part of a circle. And that's to represent the head, obviously. His head's going to have, he's going to have a pretty big head. I'm going to come into like a point here. And then uh, I'm going to actually draw like the flares of his uh, head. And they're just little rectangular shapes come into each other. Nothing too special. And his body is going to be very similar to the other bodies. I'm going to be drawing a most, you know, big torso. Upper body, you know, he's basically have like a stuffed animal's body, and then on it, I'm gonna throw the suit, and then I'm gonna actually connect the hair down. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the suit first to kind of get that out of the way, which would be the shirt. Small tie would be black, right? That tie shape. This would be the collar right there. The stripes on his shirt here, on his whole outfit. Uh, upper part of a suit. And then his suit has stripes going vertically. And then same thing goes for the pants. I'm going to try them to make them not line up with the upper part so that you can tell so it doesn't look like it's totally across. And I believe he has black shoes on. I'm just going to throw a little bit of an extra, you know, layer toward the bottom to kind of indicate the shoes. And this is the very similar to the way I usually draw eyes. They're going to be low on the head. And kind of this egg shaped, you know what I mean? Or oval, really. I guess egg would indicate a smaller area toward the bottom. And I'm going to leave a little bit of space open there for the yellow of the eyes that's going to be. The little smile in the middle. And I'm going to have his green teeth sticking out of that. And what we're going to do is we're going to color him. And hopefully more like like you know more detail would come out in the color. What I'm gonna grab is I'm gonna grab the Rose Art brand of colored pencils. And so what I really want to do with that is I'm gonna get different kinds that kind of match the values that I see with you know been in Beetlejuice. So lavender I feel would be good for his skin. It's very similar to the kind of cartoon show. It's kind of like this sickly purple. I'm using the side of my pencil 
I'm, I'm kind of moving in a circular manner. And I'm being careful not to fill in the eye or even the teeth. And filling it in as so. Take care of his hand as well, his hands. That purple look to him. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a yellow. I'm going to find a yellow. Actually, I'm going to actually use a yellow marker. Whoops. The yellow marker came apart. Let me grab a uh, yellow colored pencil and fill in the eyes. And also the hair is kind of blonde, so I'm going to use that same yellow to just kind of lightly throw in for the hair. And I'm going to do it very rapidly. You know what I mean? It's supposed to be like blondish, so I'm not going to kind of harp on it. You know what I mean? It doesn't have to be like super bright yellow or anything. And then I'm going to grab uh, this color I used last time called Celery for the teeth. Let me sharpen it real fast. And I'm going to grab a darker uh, color. And this color is called a Raspberry. And that's going to be for the shirt that he has. That shirt that he buttons up. You know, underneath the suit itself, and that's pretty much it. Uh, you know, if you want him to maybe be floating, because sometimes he floats. You know, he, he can fly, right? In some iterations, he can fly. I think in the Ghost World, he can fly. Then you can do that. But uh, that's pretty much it. That is a cute uh, Halloween Beetlejuice, and that's about it. Thanks a lot, guys. I'll see you later.